Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Make it make sense. Yes, that's where we are. And thank you for my new subscribers that have come over and tried to help build this channel. Uh, continue to come over because I have 548 more people I need until I meet my thousand, okay? And I know we can do it. I know we can do it. So I just need five. 148 people go tell your friends go tell your enemies go tell your associates go tell your uh what do you call it um uh, what do you call it uh cohorts go find them go tell them come on over to the channel subscribe like and share but mostly subscribe and like the videos okay that's what we're doing over here now you have come to the house and it's time for us to have a conversation. Yes, we got to have a conversation about this particular topic because I don't know where we're going with it. I don't know how he do what he do, but I guess he just say, hey, I'm rich. I'm famous. I can do pretty much anything I want to do. I can sit and lay up for a year not doing anything to anyone, and I can go to any place under the sun and just everything. But we're going to be talking about Will Smith's son, Jaden Smith, walking around here with a dollhouse as a pocketbook, okay, or a purse, as they would say, and I'm like, I tried to rationalize it, I said it might just be for the public, or it just might be for show, uh, because he was at a Louis Vuitton Paris Week fashion show, and maybe he just wanted to add that extra flair, I have no idea, because the little jacket he have on, it's like a crop top, it's almost like a, a, a woman's outfit, but he's wearing it to the best of his, you know, capabilities. And I like the outfit on him. But behind it, when he picked up that uh, dollhouse, I said, now, where are we going with this? Now, he done took a 360-degree turnaround on my ass, okay? I said, now, where is he going, dog, with this uh, dollhouse? Because, you know, dollhouses are meant for little girls, Okay. They fantasize, they play with their other friends, with their dollhouse, so they play by themselves. Oh, yes, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and thank you for watching, okay? We always want to have old members of the family come in, but we enjoy the new ones that also want to come in and rock with us. Because all thing we're doing is sitting on a coffee table, we're sitting on the floor, we're sitting in sofas, chairs, however you want to see yourself relaxing. And we just bring up a, a topic of discussion to uh, play around with. And, you know, if it was funny as hell, we'll be kicking and laughing over here. But, uh, yeah, I don't know what's the hell going on with Jaden. I mean, I think he was in a rock band one time, and then he was saying he had a boyfriend in Tyler, the Creator. But Tyler, the Creator, never came out and said shit. <laughs> if anything, Jaden Smith blew his cover because he wasn't trying to come out to the public, if indeed he is gay. All right, and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching, and like my video, please, and thank you. But, okay, we have this article from popsugar.com and we have Avery Matera that wrote it for us wrote it up for us but uh I want y'all to make sure y'all hit that notification bell button for the ones that are subscribed so you'll know when I upload and drop new content to the channel so you can come on over here and do what you got to do and make comments in the uh comment section about the video not me <laughs> And let's get these 548 more people that we need to solidify that thousand for our subscribers for this channel, okay? I know we can do it if we work together. I have faith in you. Have faith in me, okay? But this is the outfit that I was telling y'all about, okay? I didn't too much care for the checkerboard because it's got too much like a Masonic type thing motif is giving me. But that's okay. You know, it's, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. And I like the little flap that he shows on his pocket. On his uh, left side of his jacket pocket. It's like a little tag that you would put on, I guess, your luggage or whatnot. And I said, oh, okay, that's unique. That's unique. But when I saw that damn dollhouse, I said, what the hell is going on here? <laughs> Do he have his lunch in there? Do he have a pet in there? What is going on with this boy? You got Will Smith already out there trending because he don't like what Chris Rock came back a year later and got on his ass about and he want to say, you know, take it back or move on. No, 
Chris ain't moving on till he get ready to move on. And if it was me, I would be petty for at least six or seven eight years. <laughs> I would be dogging you and your wife out because pretty much he can do it because he's a comedian. But, Will, you're an actor, okay? That's what you do. You cry. You get up that emotion and make those water work cause tears to, you know, fill your eyes and drip down your cheek. But um, nobody's really caring for that either. But we're talking about your son right now in this big-ass dollhouse that he's going around with. They have locks on the side. I'm, I'm still trying to figure out what is going on with that. But anyway, like I said, we have a story by Pop Sugar and uh, Avery. Uh, it's a journalist who wrote up the piece for that particular company. And she titles it, Jaden Smith Wiles in a Crop Top and a Dollhouse Purse at Paris Fashion Week. Okay? Or they called it PFW to shorten it up. Uh, she goes on to say in her article, on the final few days of Paris Fashion Week, celebrities stepped out in droves to turn heads in front row at the fall 2023 one-way show. On Monday, March 6th, Jaden Smith made a statement at Louis Vuitton with an onlooker doing a double take at both of his outfit and handbag, wearing a coordinated black and white denim crop trucker jacket and pants the 24 year old star finished his look with chunky soul black shoes layered chain necklaces and a louis vuitton tag fastened to one of his breast pockets his handbag was the piece de resistance appearing to be more of a miniature dollhouse than a purse while smith matching set would have the heads all on its own due to its splash flashy a splashy graphic pattern and crop silhouette. The accessory was a remarkable update. With the top handle made of Louis Vuitton's iconic light tone leather, the bag is shaped like a house with hinges that allow both the sides and top to open. Smith shared the uh, backstory on Instagram, writing, Thank you at Louis Vuitton for letting me hold this amazing piece. This bag is a replica of the house of the founder of Louis Vuitton lived in and created his first workshop for the company in and thank you at was it nicholas grishire something like that for another amazing show smith always has been a fashion lover who challenged traditional gender norms by wearing dresses crop tops skirts and i did say skirts yes that some might consider feminine well, yes, we do consider it feminine, how he was wearing them. Now, they put a picture in here of that. And see, he's making a mockery out of himself, and they're taking pictures of his hair, as well as the outfit, and they're coming from the side trying to take a picture of the dollhouse. Now, what kind of nut we go around with? I just say Will Smith and his children. I don't know. I don't know, because Willow kind of out there with herself, too, with that gothic, metal, heavy metal type uh, motif she got going on, and I don't know, uh, uh, what's her name? Jada out there was screwing everybody and anybody. I guess uh, Jada, he ain't bringing no more friends to the house, allegedly, for her to get with. You know what I'm saying? We got Will crying, crying over there. So we just got a messed up family, okay? They have nothing but drama. And they love to sit at that red table talk and spill the tea. On their own damn selves. So, you know, if they ask you to come be a guest, they ain't going to have no mercy on you. They sure are not. But going back to the article, it says, um, where are we? Where are we? And while there's a fair amount of retro streetwear to be seen from designer Nicholas G. Current spring 2023 men's collection, there are plenty of, uh, tiered chiffon skirts, uh, knife pleated dresses layered beneath crop tops, and the duster coats printed with electric lavender florals that would be in line with Smith's at aesthetic. Okay? <laughs> I'm like, do Will Smith have the run of the meal of a little bit of time? And he can go up there and dress. Well, he has dressed in dresses. I ain't gonna lie. I seen him sporting a few. And he definitely liked those skirts where most, it kind of is made up like a kilt. But he he wearing a skirt. He, he had probably bloomers on it up too for his underwear. I don't know. You know, really don't care. But it just is what it is. Okay, going back to the article, it says, Smith's latest outfit, however, seems to have been customized by Nicholas um, G. Just last season, he wore equally headlining, making look 
at Louis Vuitton show during Paris week, Paris uh, Fashion Week in a mirrored crop top. Okay. With other celebrities in attendance at the fall 2023 Louis Vuitton show, like Zendaya, uh, Cleo, Grace, uh, Mortez, Serena Williams, Emma Stone, and more. It was a star-studded affair, to be sure. Okay, now we're getting some black designers, you know what I'm saying? And showcase the billions uh, of the Switzerland, the New York. Well, we, got, well, we can't have black designers here in Atlanta. And I know they're running around here and everywhere else. Why don't our superstars that are black wear black designer clothing? I don't know why. We can't pick up that uh, pole and run with it, you know? And showcase more black designers out there. They're ca- they're ca- uh, what do you call it? The Italians don't had it for many, 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 many years. Now, I want somebody to go out there and say that. And boycott, you know what I'm saying? Boycott, okay? So we can have a, a full plethora of every nationality out there showcasing and wearing their gowns and, and suits and clothing at any uh, event, social event. You see what I'm saying? But I ain't got no more for this video, and I'll see y'all on the next one. But make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you next time.